This is a video on the complex numbers for the HP Prime. There are two considerations you'll have to keep in mind when working with the complex numbers for the HP Prime. These are the angle measure and whether you want the complex number displayed in brackets or whether you want the eye displayed with the complex number. This settings menu can be found under the shift home key. To enter a complex number simply click on the brackets enter your real part, click comma, and enter the imaginary part. There is also an, a secondary method by entering the brackets, entering the real part, clicking plus or minus, clicking I using shift 2, and then entering the complex number. Mathematical operations with complex numbers are relatively simple. You can add subtract, multiply and divide complex numbers simply by adding, adding them on the command line in the appropriate manner. As an example, we can add 10 plus 2i to 1 plus 1i, which gives a result of 11 plus 3i. Another technique is to multiply your complex number by a scalar. Here we have 10 plus 20i multiplied by 2 gives a result of 20 plus 40i. In a similar manner we can multiply two complex numbers together. Here you can see 10 plus 20i multiplied by 2 plus 4i which gives a result of minus 60 plus 80i. We can also divide by a scalar. Here we have 10 plus 20i divided by 2, which gives a result of 5 plus 10i. Additionally, you can divide by a complex number. Here we have 10 plus 20i divided by 2 plus 2i. This gives us a result of 7.5 plus 2.5i. Up until this point we've been dealing with rectangular complex numbers. You can also enter polar complex numbers by using the angle key which is shift and multiply. You can also use the angle operator to convert between rectangular and polar formats. Having the complex number on the command line and clicking shift angle will toggle between these two. You can also enter the angle in degrees by using the shift fraction button or the degrees, minutes and seconds button. And finally you can convert from radians to degrees by multiplying by 180 and dividing by pi. I hope you enjoyed this video and learned something from it. If you enjoyed this, please like and subscribe. Have a nice day.